Fans are one of the most common household objects. Whether it's a ceiling fan, tower fan, personal, or box fan, most everyone has them. Over time, fans have evolved from handheld to electric. Fans were originally made and used in Egypt to cool people down in the desert heat. The first record of fans being used is in 4000 BC when palm leaves were used to fan pharaohs and those of the upper class. This artifact helps to enhance the quality of the human experience because it can improve the environment of the room or area it is being used in. If it is too hot, it can help to cool down an individual or the room as a whole to increase the quality of life. The fan eventually made its way over to China and Japan, where it became the folding fan. In 17th century China, folding fans were decorated with scenes of mountains, flowers, people, and patterns. They could be made out of paper or even animal feathers. Fans were also used as art in dance known as fan dance. The fan as an artifact helps to explain design as a creative product of culture because the original fans were hand fans that were typically used by people of a high social status. The fans were also painted with scenes, patterns, and designs that reflected the culture they were being used in. The fan has evolved to become a common household object and is designed to be used by anyone and everyone today. In Chinese culture, fans were used to perform Chinese fan dances, which are a direct product of that culture. The hand fan made its way over to Europe in the 1500s and became an ideal accessory for the upper class. In cultural practices, hand fans are highly valued and used as a canvas for artwork. These art pieces can then be displayed and even sold for a lot of money. My artifact shows that over time an object's meaning can change. The fan went from being an accessory for the rich and a symbol of high social class to becoming a household object that can be used every day by anyone or even tossed to the side somewhere in a closet. The media has affected the way we view this object and has taken away the meaning behind it for being only an object of royalty. In 1882, the first electric fan was made by Schuyler Scott's Wheeler. This fan was just two blades with no cage around it. Nowadays, all electric fans have a protective cage around the blades, aside from ceiling fans. This is a safety precaution. A fan displays the value of design in business, social, and cultural practices because it is an everyday object that is used regularly in these situations. The design of a fan makes it easy to place in small areas and use on a hot day in the office, to keep a room cool during a social gathering, or to cool down a hot kitchen. This can be an important factor to keep everyone comfortable and satisfied. Fans are a highly consumed product in the world of consumerism, especially in areas with a hotter climate. There are many different designs and styles of fans. There are some that are designed to be higher tech and chic looking. For example, the Dyson Cool fans, which are geared toward the upper class and those who can afford a more expensive fan for a quieter output. Because fans are so common, they are designed well. They are designed with the intent of being easy to use, energy saving, cheap, easily movable, and size varying. There are many styles that can fit anyone's specific needs. The fan is a prime example of how design fits in the world. The design has evolved to become better equipped and easy to use for all. It is something that is seen in many settings and is even designed to fit in and be unnoticed in some situations.